Hi friends, thank you for joining me today and Happy New Year, Happy 2019. I hope you all are doing well and you are um, well past the holidays. I know I am. I am currently right now bringing out all of my Valentine goodies, um, but I wanted to confess a couple of things before I showed you this book that I made. I was not really big into Maggie Holmes. Um, until recently when I came across one of the patterns that I really, really loved. And then I started looking and looking more and looking more and I just became obsessed. So um, one of my friends, Becca, I believe she's Inspire and Create, she um, and I decided to go ahead and do a swap and I wanted to show you the book I made her. Now, um, it was supposed to be a pocket letter, but I decided to go this route instead of um, making an actual pocket letter. I made her a book with pockets. So here is the front. Um, as you can see, it, I just put her name and I tried to um, make it as um, dimensional as I could. Um, I, one of my friends sent me this strip in one of the swaps that I received and I just think it's absolutely gorgeous. I really hate to part with it because I don't know where these iridescent stars are from. However, um, because it's the carnival, I went ahead and I included it. And at the top here, it was just some like hangover and I just added a little bit. Now, this is my very first book. So if you guys can think of anything um, to make it better, let me know by leaving comments below. Um, I do know that the next time I, I know more a little bit, you know, now that I've done it, I know now how to switch it up. So hopefully um, she'll love it because this is actually going to be hard for me to part with. Um, so opening up the book on the first page, now I haven't put anything here yet, I'm going to put her letter here, um, but starting it off, I added, uh, made her a little tassel and a little bell, just so that she can have some fun noise, and then I made um, the ticket, here's her ticket booth, and then I put the uh, ticket on the side with some ephemera on the inside. Um, and again, I just added some personal touches just to try to make it a little bit more dimensional and make it pop. Um, I used the, I want to say, it, I know it's not the carousel. Maybe it is the carousel collection. I'm not sure. Again, I'm not that familiar with all of them yet, but hopefully within, um, you know, the next month or so, I'll be able to know everything. Um, I absolutely love this. I think it's gorgeous. This is a beautiful set of ephemera, and I just, I had so much fun playing with it. Um, here on the ice cream, what I did was I just added one of the rosettes I got from um, confetti, um, and I made it, I made the wheel, and I added a bow at the top. I didn't want to take too much away from this. I just love the simplicity of this, but I think it's so cute. I also added some blue star washi um, because, of course, everything uh, is stars. So on this side, I made a carousel, and I added the little um, dot on there, and I just added that on a 3D pop-up to make it more dimensional. This next page, I kept it simple, and I just added the black and white um, tent in back of the black carousel. I thought that was really cute. And I just randomly stuck these cute little cards. Um, this one says merry-go-round. This one right here, um, this is the, I wanna say she's from, I can't, I can't think of the name. I, I, I just love the little pen, I think it's cute. Um, I made this from her paper, a little six by six I had. I also used this from the um, Celebrate, I think I want to say Celebration. I could be saying it wrong, you guys, please forgive me. I added, I had some of these really pretty um, gold leaves and I added a couple of my own that I picked up from Hobby Lobby and with a couple of hers. Um, and then I added some of the trim that she has in her stash. And I'm also going to be sending this to Becca. 
On this page, I just have, um, this one is the cotton candy, and um, it, I put a frame over here. It says happy heart, because who's not happy when you go to the carnival? I know I am. On this part, I made some page flags, really cute. I thought they were cute anyway. Um, and I added a little dot, a little gold heart on pop-up dots. Um, and then of course I made a whole bunch and she could, um, so that she could use her gift or whatever she wanted to do with those. On the next page is just the cute little bunny and um, I kept it simple and I added the little pom-pom and some foo-foo on the tail. And again, I just added this really pretty flower and I know it doesn't really go very well, but I think the colors kind of do and I, and I like it a lot. So I added that and that is from one of her uh, cut apart. I wanna say um, that's one of 12 by 12s. This part right here, um, I just made into, I cut into these little pockets this side as well and this is a little bag I received and I kept it for years since probably had it two years this is cotton candy and I love this picture right here and this actually came from uh, again I think it's the celebration 3d stickers um, but it went perfectly with this picture so I added the bow and I just added some gold just to make it pop a little bit. And in the back, I didn't want to leave it empty, so I added a flower and happy soul shine. This is also another one of her pieces. And this is one, one of the things we were going to do is we were going to send a memory decks cards as well. And so this is her, one of her memory decks cards. It's got the with love and this is the Maggie Holmes flowers I got this beautiful butterfly I can't even I don't even remember when but I added a B for her name and it's in the back of that really pretty swan pink paper and then on this side I made happy 2019 memory decks um, if you guys remember I posted them and I also included one for her and on this side I have the horse on the carousel and I added um, let me see, what is this called? I added the Nouveau Drops to the bottom to kind of just make it pop. I added it to the eyes with a little heart. And I just love these colors. I think these colors are just beautiful. And then I just added a piece of gold trim to just coordinate and combine it all. This page right here is just a hello and some balloons um, that came with the ephemera. And then I made this little piece out of some random pieces. I thought it was really pretty and I wanted to add some color to correspond with the balloons. And finally, this page right here is probably one of my favorite pages and it took me the longest to make. Um, it says happiness is here that did come with the ephemera the little cat as well and I made the little heart rosette that um, everyone is doing right now with another page flag and the corresponding colors so I tried to keep it all in the same uh, color scheme um, and that is all that I have for this book now I'm also including um, I'm going to include some goodies like this and I just all I need to do is add the top but I'm going to add um, some goodies that I made and then some more little file folders. And then of course these bows that um, I think are so pretty and I just love the um, combination of colors. I think her, her, everything is just so beautiful in her stash. I'm also gonna send her, um, this is a Maggie Holmes, of, ephemera pack or this is the um standout flourish flourish standout so i'm going to mail her a couple of these and i also have um but now that i can't find it i am so sorry it is a gift and it has oh here it is okay now i did box it up into this and i thought it would be fun and on the inside I picked up a whole bunch of these pretty boxes, um, about 12, I think, or 15, and they were like 
I want to say a dollar for the whole stash. So I'm really lucked out where I, where I shop in my little craft Goodwill. Um, so I filled it up with this confetti paper um, and I am gifting her some of the Maggie Holmes um, trim along with this little hello. And then of course, who doesn't love the llama? Love, love this llama. I think it's so cute. I think I picked this up at Walmart, but I love the glasses. I think it's so cute. And it just kind of went along with the whole circus carnival thing. And then I put in here some extra um, rosettes that I made. And finally, I made some telephones. And um, I am going to just send these so that she can decorate them however she wants and use them for her crafts. I'm also including some memory decks cards um, and more than likely I'm going to send her, you know, much more bling and ribbon and stuff like that. But I just wanted to show you before I packaged it all up tonight to send it to her. Um, what I had done, I hope you guys like it. Let me know uh, in the comments below. If you like this, please give me a thumbs up. And if you have not already, please subscribe to uh, my page. Uh, hit the bell to be up notified of any new uploads um, and my goal for this year which everyone was calling a um, resolution I believe my goal is just to send phenomenal mail um, and that is something that I am working very hard to do and at first it's going to take me a little bit longer but you guys know how much this community means to me I love you guys and I will talk to you again soon have a great rest of your day bye